Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Enter the Gungeon. Beat the Gungeon. Rainbow Run Day Sunday. We are on the final episode before we unlock everything. Not the final episode of the series, final episode of the series, series episode of the series final. <laughs> we are just on the last episode that will unlock anything. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, thank you very much. All we gotta do is beat the dragon today. Do we think we could, this room looks different. I feel like I haven't seen that room before. Like, <laughs> how is that possible? Anyway, yeah, we're on the final episode that we will unlock anything new ever again. We uh, we will keep on going until we pick up the other items, which may be honestly, like, outrageously soon. May not be outrageously soon. We will see. We'll see. We'll probably uh, we'll probably pick up all the items and then do like a like a true finale or something. But that's that. And then afterwards, if you've been uh, not here, if you haven't been keeping track, holy moly, of what's going on in the series. After this, we're going to probably take like a, a smidgen off. There's a mimic there. Just like a smidgen off where like we will actually probably finally do the tier lists of the, uh, the weapons and items that everybody's been asking me to do for God knows how long. We'll finally, finally do it, finally get it in, uh, in right in there. And then we're going to start ourselves a Mod the Gungeon series. So I'm very excited about that. We'll start the, the Mod the Gungeon series. We'll download, hopefully, a bunch of cool new mods. Once again, I keep on saying this because I just want everybody to who uh, wants to make mods to know. If you want, Kyle the Scientist has a tutorial on how to make custom passive items, etc., etc. Custom passives, custom guns are very much the, uh, the biggest thing that I'm most excited about in the uh, the potential perspective uh, mod pack for our mod the gungeon series so do do get to work now if you want them in the first episode of that series that's just what i'm getting at there but yeah any anything uh, anything is welcome I'm, uh, throw it throw it my way if you uh, if you're making a mod let me know do let me know there is a couple cool things that i'm i'm very much excited to get into there is like a there's a hard mode that's being developed uh, there is a, let's see, there, there's obviously like the endless mode, the uh, the greed mode, all kinds of that stuff. There's guns, there's passives, there's new characters, there's all of that. Apparently even like a, a Mario Maker-esque situation. God, apparently there's a, there's freeze on this too? I guess that just the, uh, the planet can freeze. I think we should be tap shooting. So is not to absolutely waste our ammo. I mean, look at that damage when we <laughs> when we wait versus when we uh, when we keep on holding fire. Definitely better to do that so we don't waste nearly as much ammo. Way better. And it's a syner synergied up Gunder Fury against the very first boss. So... Oh. I think we're going to be fine. But it's really special that this ended up on a Rainbow Run Day Sunday. We always talk about it. Like, I mean, yeah, 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 you know, sh shut up about designing Rainbow Mode, yada, yada. But it's more just like, uh, it, it, it's it's so symbolic. Like, all these special fun events keep lining up on Rainbow Run Day Sunday. Which is, what once, uh, once again, probably I will go down in history as the single greatest, like, gaming achievement I'll probably ever have. Is, is getting an official mode added to the game. It's just, it's very, it's very special that all this stuff keeps on happening it, coincidentally on Rainbow Run Day Sunday. Hell, we'll probably just like ride it out and end the series on a Rainbow Run Day Sunday at this rate too. Like, it's probably just gonna end up that way and, that, and that's crazy and that's very neat. All right. Magic sweet, maybe. Yeah, magic sweet. Hard to pass it up. It's just too good to eat. Thank you, sweet. We may or may not go to the Abbey of the True Gun. I'm not sure. I don't know. It's one of the ones that you can kind of like... <laughs> you can kind of accidentally not go. There's that, and then there's like... 
is the rat you can miss m miss the pattern but this is one where it's like if you're paying attention you you still might not be able to go because you might get bopped you know you might get bopped you might get slapped show me what you got but yeah pumped for the mod series we're gonna obviously do some like custom challenges we're gonna try out uh the uh, uh one thing i'm really excited to get back to is the eden mode in the uh, custom isaac game modes mod which is effectively but Rito, that's just paradox no it's paradox but with stats as well you can i remember i had a run where uh i got totally bescrewed but it, it makes for an interesting time you can get like you can get really slow movement speed you can get horrible accuracy you can get busted stats too but like i know we, we had a run where we literally started with one red hp and it was uh it was a problem it was a problem but in a more more real sense it was kind of exciting you know it's kind of exciting because like it, it just it provides a level of uh uncertainty and spiciness that you just don't get out of paradox Par paradox is just like hey what if you had a basic character but they're better than the average character they're not better than the best character i mean they, they can be like on paradox you literally could get lich eye bullets and uh i don't know and a gun that's but like lich eye bullets and cactus you could start with that which if you don't know cactus is totally busted with lich eye bullets it's just like weirdly busted i don't know it must be a combination of a couple of the synergies but Really, just that cactus flower synergy is truly, truly nuts. All right. I hope we get some ammo for cheap. How much is ammo on this floor? All right. Well, time to use our standard. I'll tell you what. We'll, uh, we'll assert dominance. If we make it there without taking damage. Oh, no. Oh, no. All right. Well, never mind. I take it back. What I just said is irrelevant. I don't even know. Oh, there, there. That's that's probably the way to have gone. Oh, boy. That <laughs> was way spicier than I would have liked. Okay. I mean, okay. Keys nice and all. I was kind of hoping for maybe like some ammo. We got to be finding our, our big boss some here. Some, some here. Something close. Where you at, Mr. Big Boss? Mr. Big Boss, send me your dreams. I wanna kill you with Gundramada memes. I seem like I, I, I just always get Gundramada on, on this mode. <laughs> and I'm like, I'm happy about it. Like, I always talk about it. I mean, that, okay. I know we like stop talking about modded series, but I'm just I'm just pumped. I'm, I'm trying to generate hype. It's called marketing. No, it's called uh, I just can't stop talking about it because I'm excited about it. Um, the turning off the boss the boss damage cap is gonna happen. At least we're gonna see we're gonna see what it's like when it happens. Everybody want always wants it off. I always say I want it off, and it's gonna be interesting to see what what it actually does. What weapons that maybe aren't so great become great. What weapons that were great become stupidly great i'm pumped i'm pumped the runs are probably going to be on average pretty wacky strong if i were to guess but we're we're definitely going to try to balance it out with some uh, some tough tough challenges some unique challenges yep i guess we're just going to not do this with ammo that's fine i'm not really worried about it we get hit we get hit then we just did not uh, we did not correctly assert dominance and that is a okay. I mean we can do this just I mean the gunslinger standard is pretty darn solid and this fight is really Oh I almost messed up. Really, really pattern based. The like RNG of the bullet pathing is kind of just in that move that he, he just did right there. Other than that, it's pretty darn pattern based. Be pretty, pretty 
muscle memoried. Even this one too, you can you can guide them. They home in on you. As long as you're moving in the you know, generally same way. It's a it's a pretty easy one. This this one can be goofy too, just cause like some of them can come out of nowhere on the side of the screen, you know. Can be spicy. Can be dicey. We got our blank too. Let's just do it. Just buys us the extra time there. We already found the secret room. No reason to hold on to it. I don't think there's anything worth buying. All right, we out of here. Okay. Ammo economy. Or bullet modifiers. Bullet modifiers are always, always a good time. Okay. Coolness up based off of curse. Sounds good to me. Beepity bobbity beep. That should mean that we do have more opportunities to get consumables and things like that. Uh, things like the good old fashioned ammo drop. But in addition, if we ever do get an active item, we can keep in mind that we have a little bit of coolness. <laughs> I missed. Yeah. Don't drop it. All right. Can't wait. We're, we're probably gonna like. I don't know. What kind of what kind of custom runs can we do? I, I've been meaning to go back and do like a uh, a thrown gun run too. Like you can really you can do a lot of goofiness <laughs> with the the thrown guns explode item, which apparently is still a thing, even though. Uh, even though the Ruby Bracer has changed, apparently that is still there. Oh heck. I've just never tried I've just never tried because throwing guns is let's be honest. Not that strong. But it you know, it, it, it does something, it does something. Let's buy the key, get it out of the way. <laughs> Literally throwing gun their fury. Does he do, but what if this whole time, maybe he does bonus damage with thrown guns, since he's the gun slinger. Yeah, I knew that was coming, I knew that was coming. Oh no, we don't get a go to the Abbey. This is my sad face. That is not a problem at all. Not a problem at all. These runs get pretty long regardless. We can always go to the RNG department if we want to. We're already going to the rat. Already went to the sewer. Hardly an issue, in my opinion. Oh. Beep, 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 beep. Spicy. Let's get in the middle. Get in the middle of this swirly. Uh oh. <laughs> He's trying to sumo wrestle me out of my out of my ring. Okay. You just rainbow mode. It's always just like it's low ammo mode. That is that is like the facts. Was there there was an ammo for sale? Was there? I would have picked it up. Yep. Yeah. All right. Boss. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ammo drop. Ammo drop. Before the boss. But I want to bop you. Obviously, <laughs> like starting with Gunder Fury is hardly an issue where we could uh, potentially com uh, complain about anything for the whole run. No, not really. We can't. Not when you start with Gunder Fury. If you start with Gunder Fury and complain, you're a goofus. A straight up goofus. Just do not leave it. <laughs> Just don't leave it on the ground. There's that. That's where I put my crest if I had one. Uh oh. I regret this. I see a pit. 
I see a pit in the room. I see an exploding boyo in the room. I regret my decision. Okay. She wanted to pick it up before anything happened. Before anything on earth happened. Because I think you can explode the guns, like, away. I think you can make them bounce around and cause some severe problems there. I just, I feel like I just need more buttons to press than the normal standard fire, you know? This actually is really gonna suck. This is one of the bosses where if you actually don't have a decent weapon, things can go awry. Just because the adds can stack up, the, uh, the rockets can obviously stack up. I'm gonna blank, so I'm just buying myself some time to get some more distance. Okay. More rockets. Thank you, table. Got the lucky little table version, too, of the room. You can just do that. Alright. Get the hell away. Get the hell away. We have one more blank we can use. Okay. Uh-oh. This is when it gets spicy, though. This is when it gets real spicy. When you kind of just left ads around. I think I I think I did. Is there one stuck in his bod? Doesn't matter. He's a joke. Get wrecked, goober. Get wrecked, goober. I guess we're out of here. We don't need any money. That being said, fine. We'll, we'll do it twice because there's no reason not to. We got money in the bank this way. Thank you very much. Oops. All right. Onward, downward. Like, I want ammo. But also, we'll see. I'm not doing the test gun makeshift cannon. Honestly, we don't even really need makeshift cannon right now. Spice is, of course, interesting. All right. Spice up your life. Every boy, every girl, spice up your life. We'll get that so that uh, <coughs> we get other things replaced by it in the future here, especially if we got coolness up, especially if we do have six chamber. I just feel like it's the way to go, you know? Makeshift cannon, it cool. It cool, but it also doesn't matter. I feel like I would just rather have, you know, a stronger room clear because we already can we can kill bosses just fine. I ain't worried about it. We got the uh, the Gunder Fury. Okay. Stop it. Stay still. Got the Gunder Fury. I'm trying to save it up a little bit. It's as good as a makeshift cannon almost for boss killing. Honestly, it's so it's it's a guaranteed boss damage cap, and then some. You just you you slap slap up on that boss damage cap, and then you can. Uh, holy crap, that didn't go great. I'm gonna bring out the big guns for just a mere moment. Slap that DPS cap, and then lay lay off the gas for a hot moment. We could cleanse our curse. Normally with six chamber, I feel like that's stupid, but. I think that that is an interesting idea when we just picked up spice now we can totally pick up even more spice <laughs> that's what that means we can pick up so much spice now yes our curse is down but hopefully hopefully the coolness will make it uh, make it relatively prevalent because it should uh, I think it can replace our consumables the drop at the end of the room you know, so we might as well try. And you can still, uh, you can still find spice in shops. On rainbow mode. Because it's, it's a weird item. It's, it's, it is a passive, it's, a, or it's an active passive, you know, it's an item. It's a pickup, though, more than anything. It, it's kind of just, it's effectively a consumable that, uh, 
happens to take up your space bar slot. It's a weird item. It's so weird in that sense. Spice it up. Spice up your life. Nope. That being said, where the hell is the rat? Oh, well, there you go. Thank you very much. I love when this is the rat room because they, you don't even have to look. It's just here. Why are we so... Oh, okay, Magic Suite. I was like, why are we so fast? Like, I know why we're kind of fast, but why are we so fast? I'm going to throw myself into the pit once. I want to save one blank for the boss fight. So we can use the shield for the first blank and then a blank for the second blank. Blink. All right, we need $144 for potential spice in the shop. I, I'm, I wouldn't be surprised if it wasn't there, though, at this point. It really, it takes a little bit before it really infects the shop entirely, and you can effectively uh, assume it'll be there. All right. Yeah, it ain't here. It ain't here. I think we do this. I think it's worth it. There's something to be said for waiting until after the boss. But I'm going to say, yeah, who cares? We'll get ammo back before we fight the rat. Oh, man, I love that slowdown. It's so helpful. So helpful, as long as it doesn't just wear off randomly here. I think we're going to kill him before he even ends his phase here. Sad day to be Cannon Balrog. Oh my god, the slowdown absolutely gutted him. Alright, now we go. Any reason to stay? We could try to find a blank spot. Yeah, alright. Well, yep. we didn't have to use the shield, but it's okay. I'm not really uh, worried about my health, to be honest. Not really a thing that I've got concerns about. Not really. All right. Spice up your life. At the same time, it's just like, I feel weird about doing it because then it's like... All right, we're going to do one more spice right now from a chest, and we're not going to take spice from chests anymore because we should just get them. Up, up, down, right, down, up. We should just get them from other rooms now. Next is up. Next is down. We can spam our ammo. We'll get it back before the boss. Next is down. Hup. Next is right. Next is down. God. Up and done. This just is so... This gun is nuts. Who thought it was okay? Because I want to give him a big thank you. Okay, slow him down before he... Oh, I thought we could slow him down so he took longer to get to the center. We could actually get more time to damage him. Okay, he's going to go invincible. I have to itch my nose. Oh, no, this is a terrible time. We want to actually get a little bit closer. Because it makes the... Uh... You want to get closer and then walk away. Because the closer you are, the ease... The bigger the... Uh... Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? The closer you are, the bigger the gaps are. And then the further away are you are, the easier it is to uh, get to them. So you kind of want to be up here when he's choosing to cast them and then you go back so you kind of want to do something like like this kind of like that during that phase it's weird it's weird that's that's like the technically optimal but i don't know there's something to be said for just walking really far away something to be said for just blanking that something to be said for handling it in all kinds of different ways it's a weird one yeah, I saw that coming. Beep it, bobby boop. Aww. All right. I should have spaced it out. I was just trying. I was trying. Oh my god, did I try to break his uh, 
arm. What the hell? What the hell? Are you kidding me? <laughs> you stinker! It just didn't show up. It didn't just didn't show up that he did this. We got the movement speed up. I knew I was going to walk into it anyway. Got movement speed up, so it should have been relatively easier. We just started in, it. We started in a bad spot for that one. Oh, man. This is not great. Okay. Oh, no. Okay, here we go. This, this is a better start. The much better start. Starting in the bottom right corner for that. Way, way better. Bottom right or bottom left corner. Oh, my God. All right. All right. You just want to be in the corner. That is, is mostly it. So you can get in big old circle. But you get to walk around around it. Holy moly. Just getting a movement speed up makes, like, all the difference for this boss fight. Not that it's something you can always control, but... That one move. Like, I just... Not having a movement speed up and dealing with that move is just really annoying. One of the... One of the harder... Yeah. Without a movement speed up, this is one of the harder uh, moves to dodge in the game, in my opinion. <laughs> with a movement speed up, it's just fine. Oh, man. Smell it, man! Get out of here! Get out of here! He's gonna drop. Yeah, I was gonna say he's gonna drop at least one spice. Oops. Whoa! Okay, so we've taken two. We got to keep it in mind. We've taken two. We'll, we'll mark it down. Okay, I'm gonna. I keep on trying to parry that nowadays. When you can just wait and get the easiest parry of your life. Another spice. Just another spice. Let's do the easy one. Ah, that works. Whoop! Yet another spice. All right. Well, I guess I'll just mark it down. The first one costs 0.5. And we, but we cleansed that one. So we're at, uh, I don't know where a pen is. Where the heck is a pen? So we should be at one. Right? Well, I guess maybe we don't need the market. Should be at one, I think. Three, four, five, six. All right. Yeah, we do crazy damage now, in theory. Our accuracy should be pretty bad. All in all... <laughs> Maybe not the smartest choice. We need we need just a weapon at the, <laughs> on the next floor that just does something. Just like a lot of it. Like I just need a room clear. Two, three, four, five, six. Should be at six. We might be at seven. I might have goofed. Um. Holy Grail is not something we're gonna be able to really utilize as much. Yari Launcher is hilarious. I mean, what we would be able to utilize it, but I just... Gilded Hydra sucks. Bullet Board. Yeah, fine. Yari. Yari! Just have to tap it. Just the most gentle taps. I wish we could ha have both. I do. Yeah, our damage is pretty crazy. Oops. Too many. And we missed anyway. Trying to be very, very stingy. In fact, we should actually just be using this. 
And the good news is we know we should pretty much just be able to, yeah, one-shot bop, like, everything. So just one shot. Clean. 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 One-shotting everything. Beep ba da ba. One-shotting everything. Beep ba da ba. Well, now we should have had makeshift cannon. But alas, it's hindsight. Could that turn into junk? Could that turn into junk and would we want it to turn into junk? I don't know. I don't know if I want to go to RNG department or not at this point. We don't have rat boots. Oh, man. Alright. I don't know why. I, I always get really bad feeling about that one, but it, it's never as bad as I think. Never as bad as I think. It's the worst. This is the worst room because it just means we have to waste a lot of ammo. Did he... The boy who lived? The boy who lived... Get him out of here. I see you. But yeah, Holy Grail, I mean, it's like, it's a good item. We're just going to be losing a lot of HP, though, just by picking up spice all the time. Like, we literally will actually, we will just lose a lot of HP because that's just the facts. All right. Maybe we can go to the, maybe we can go here. So we're at... I don't know. If we picked up another one, we would be... Uh, I'm going to say screwed, but like... How are you lasting that long? How did you last that long? You dirty fool. Oh yeah, we shouldn't. We probably shouldn't go. I forgot we were gonna get another. Uh, we were gonna get another master on there. I say it's probably unwise. I think we wanna not really mess. All right, I think we're at our limit. I think we're at our limit. We could also just let it happen. There's no point to do that on rainbow. We could also just let the dang things spawn. We killed the rat. Could let the dang things spawn. It's an idea. Fine. It's the it's it's the final episode. We'll see if we can get a hundred percent just like this. Why not? We have no deaths. Are we gonna die before this is this is what it's come to? The goal was to get a hundred percent unlocks. <laughs> Without dying. Okay, um... I, like, I see spice, haha, -ha, yes. But, like, we could get something better. I think, I think we would have more, more fun with this. Though, maybe not. Uh-oh. The enemies are taking longer to die than I would have liked. Uh oh. Okay, so that's not gonna be stolen. We can clear. All right, we can just. Uh... I love it. It means we just can hold down the fire button. Just as long as we turn around before the final boss of the floor. So we love to see that. 
The more curse we get, the more item drops we get. There we are. There we are. We just need to get a bunch of shields, that's all. Just need to get a bunch of shields. I would not mind uh, a little bit of curse bullets either. <laughs> I'll be real. That would be great. That would be great. Okay, well, there's ammo right there. Right, well, thank you. Um, I guess we should do this, though. And then I suppose we'll lure him over here for a smidgen? Okay. I'm surprised at how long he lasts. Also, these aren't homing in anymore because of Helix bullets, are they? Or are they? I couldn't tell. Alright. Down we go. Spice up your life. Everybody, here we go. Spice up your life. This is the way Rito dies. What's going to affect us more with the way that our build is? Platinum bullets or Gondromeda? Probably platinum. Probably platinum. But also, eh, I talked about Gondromeda. Let's get Gondromeda. All right. Tap shoot. It should lower their HP by a pretty substantial margin since they are indeed... Uh, jammed. Also, higher attack speed would just maybe... The other thing I had in mind is that higher attack speed might wreck our ammo economy. Like, we might start wasting more shots. Which is something to care about. Next. Our accuracy is going to go pretty down, but I think that that doesn't really matter with Helix Bullets. That was kind of another reason why I picked it up. Is because it kind of um, kind of nullifies accuracy penalties to an extent. I should have left that there. Oh, I should have left that there. It's okay. We'll probably get another one due to our huge amount of coolness, which is only going up and up and up the more spice we pick up. We're going to get more and more drops. So, shouldn't really matter. We should wait a little bit longer in our rooms because uh, there is actually two checks for after room drops. So if we wait a little bit longer, okay, we'll wait for that. If we wait a little bit longer, we might get a uh, we might get a second one. If, if we move too quickly, we may goof it, you know, and not actually get to pick it up. Actually, that's not relevant anymore because we did kill the rat. Never mind. We don't have to worry about nothing. Nothing can stop me. I mean, it's pretty much true. Like, we're going to be moving so quickly that it doesn't even matter that we spawned the Lord of the Jams. Oh, my God. You're saying we could start from zero? You're saying we could start from zero? That's crazy. But we kind of like, at this point, it's like, what do we want? The coolness or, or the Lord of the Jam following us? So if we cleanse it, we lose all our uh, all our coolness. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. I think we want to, uh, I think we want to keep the coolness, to be honest. The ammo drops are important. There's a chest here. Gotta break it in case there's spice. Okay, so now there's a uh, there's a full green ammo drop on the floor. I feel like we can probably afford to just 
go a little ham with our uh, our firing. Go. 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 We do not have rad boots. Do not have rad boots. Go. 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 Okay. Why don't you guys drop spice for me, you jerks? You jerks. Uh. Okay. We're definitely wanting to take the glitch lich. The glitch lich path, I'd say. I thought that gave me two spices. <laughs> All right. Oh, look. Okay, hold on. I want... I, I don't... Get, get over here. We're going to cheese this for a smidgen because I want to purchase more spice. Thank you. Buy the key because why not, I guess. All right. Here we go. Here we go. I like it. I like it. We should have waited a little bit longer so we didn't have to do this phase with the uh, Lord of the Jammed. We should have lured him further. But it looks like everything's going to... Oh, God, he is here. I didn't even notice him. We're going to get a wonderful HP up that is going to go away in a mere moment. The second we get yet another spice. Ladies and gentlemen. We've done it. We've unlocked every item. As soon as I go back and talk to that son of a gun, we've unlocked every item. Alright, I feel like that's going to be more beneficial. Did we leave any other? Nope. Nothing there. Wait. We picked this up and it just didn't even... It didn't even go because we're so negative on HP. <laughs> it didn't even give us anything. Oh, that's great. That is great. And fun thing to end it out on, to un on the final unlock episode, is that we did get the lead god. I didn't pick up the bullet that can kill the past. All right, that's fine. I knew I teleported to the blacksmith for some reason. It's okay. Because uh, the glitch lich is actually easier when you have a build like this. In a weird way. It's just, this is just going to, you know. You just might as well. It's just better. It's just better than one more spice. The sp at this point, spice is like getting a half heart pickup. You just see it all the dang time. Who cares? It's it's just like it's a freaking Tuesday. Like Nor normal is like, yeah, go for the go for the spice, go for the spice. But at this point, like, this is the memeier option because just picking up another spice is just so boring because we already have so many. I stopped tallying how many spices we have. Da -da 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 -da. We should probably start tap shooting again. Because I guess we don't know when we're gonna get an ammo drop. That being said, killing the rat means we can really, really just wait to pick it up until it's the opportune time. So that should help a lot with our ammo economy. Killing the rat, just that, that's just the, another factor, killing them. It truly does help your ammo economy if you if you really want to min-max things, just leaving it on the ground until you need it. It makes a big difference. Not wasting ammo drop. is Not wasting an ammo drop is just as useful as getting one sometimes like not wasting a, a if you can a green ammo drop yeah sometimes just as effective as getting a spread ammo drop you know statistically speakings i just walked into that i just walked into it we're gonna run out oh my god ah helix actually Gave me some st 
stinking trouble there. Get him. Got him good. Ammo. You're not gonna give me ammo. It's okay. We're gonna, like... We can actually do roughly the same business with our standard right now. I just wanted to show that off. That, like, that, that is how strong we are. We do just as much damage, almost. Not, obviously not quite. But, but kind of. Not quite, but kind of. So therefore, probably don't need to be such a stickler on it. Especially since we're obviously using Yari for the, oh. <laughs> obviously using Yari for the bows. But we can, yeah, we can use these, this here. Yeah, today turned, um, I was going to say spicy with no shred of irony. But, uh, yeah, it, 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 it's very accurate. It turned quite spicy. Okay, thank you. Our accuracy is super, super bad right now. I want to, uh, here, I'll teleport to the starting room just to show it off. Helix bullets, I'll show you why helix bullets was, uh, was one of the biggest tactical decisions of the run. Wait. Oh my god! Oh my god, is it bugged? Oh my god! We found, oh my god, we found a bug. Thank god. We are supposed to have horrible accuracy right now. But Helix bu Bullets killed it. We could drop We could drop Helix Bullets. Whoa! That or we, our accuracy got so bad that it cycled back to perfect accuracy. Oh my god, what the hell? What a find. What a freaking find. That is bizarre. Okay, well, never, never mind. I mean, that being said, yeah, it's totally a strategic... It, it was, but, like, little did I know it was double a strategic... Like, it was even more of a strategic decision than I thought it was. Because there's clearly, like... It looks like Helix Bullets, like, resets your accuracy back down to perfect or something. It, regardless of if you drop it. That's nuts. That is nuts. Wow. Okay. Oh, the things you'll learn. A thousand two hundred hours into the game. Thank you, Helix Bullets. Thank you. That is... That is crazy. What a find. That or we truly did just get such an accuracy downgrade... From uh, from spice that it cycled back here. I gotta go. I gotta go science again. That's all right. Uh, that or maybe rid of the lead gives you a perfect accuracy. Uh, no. Yeah, we just. That's like. That's a hundred percent accuracy. That is a hundred percent accuracy. That is more than that's more than the base accuracy of that gun. What on earth? Oh my god. Good game. GG Lich, no re. Oh, okay. He's not even jammed. He's not even jammed. Next. My favorite thing about the game is how hard it is. Look <laughs> I got my eye on you. 
Oh no, he's coming here, the Lord of the Jam! Get out of here! Get out of my dream sequence! Bye, buddy! Oh man, alright, back we shall go! <laughs> what a run! Back we shall go to get our final unlocks. The Grey Mauser, and in theory, the finished gun as well! We will see. Unless something bugged out. Bullet, bullet, the roof. And Will and Pascal and gun shall shoot. Oh my. I don't care about the credits. It just feels, it feels right. freaking did it we did not technically get the finished gun yet but I th think it's either like when we enter the gungeon or here we'll just enter and then we'll return to the breach or uh, maybe we need to talk to we might need to talk to the uh, the blacksmith I don't actually recall entirely it's been a hot moment but we've got that's it we we did it. We actually did it. Maybe we need to pick up the gray mauser. I didn't think that that was the case, but we can. We will. And maybe it's unlocked without us ta uh, without us getting a, a notification. But that's everything. That's the entire ammo nomicon filled out right there. The finished gun isn't even part of it. So. That being said, holy moly. Fully filled out. Fully filled out. We did it. Obviously, fully filled out, fully filled out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who cares? Okay, back to the breach. Hell yes. We've done it. Finish gun unlocked. There it is. I knew it, was at a, it unlocked at a weird time. So I think it might show up in the Ammonomicon now. Like, it might show up afterwards. But maybe not even. I, I think it's just, like, not part of it. Either way, that's it. We've done it. It's been 105 episodes? 105, I think? Let me check. It's been 105 episodes is how long it takes to unlock every item in the game if you don't cheese anything. If you don't cheese anything, it takes about 105 episodes, 105 runs without dying to do it. Oh, man. That is that. Next episode, we'll be back at it again. Like I said, we're 100% we are playing until we pick up both the Grey Mauser and the finished gun should be pretty darn, pretty darn quick though. And then we'll probably be wrapping things up, honestly, by like, by next Sunday might be the finale of this series, which is wild to me, before we start something juicy and new. Thank you for watching though, extra special thank you to D-Hex, Throbo, Nidalric, Justice Tom, The Shogun Gun, More Than Awesome, and Semi Colon P for supporting our Patreon at the Go Team Gungeon Tier. If you want to have your name shouted out at the uh, in the tier list episodes or the very beginning of the modded series, make sure you get yourself supporting on Patreon so you can get a shout out for when those come out. You can be in the uh, the initial series launch there if you support now. There's all kinds of different tiers. Get your name in the description. Get all kinds of rewards in the Discord. And you support me through these uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> apocalypse times. Oh my god. Oh my man. Thank you everybody for watching. Greatly appreciate it. Any, all, any and all support you wish to leave on this series. Up to this point in its final times. Thank you, thank you. See you next time.
Bye.